Good evening. This presentation is provided by the Pinellas County Public Works Capital Improvements Division and will discuss the Madonna Boulevard Bridge Replacement Project. The purpose of this presentation is to provide information about the project's proposed improvements, design considerations, temporary traffic control during construction, and the anticipated project schedule. The project is located in Tierra Verde at the entrance to the Monte Cristo community in southwest Pinellas County. Project limits for the bridge replacement and roadway improvements extend from 6th Avenue North on the west side to 4th Avenue North on the east. Utility replacement work may go beyond these limits along Madonna Boulevard, but will have limited impact on the surrounding area. The existing bridge carrying Madonna Boulevard over Pine Key Cutoff was constructed in 1957 and rehabilitated in 2005. The bridge is comprised of three 60-foot spans and carries two 16-foot travel lanes with one-foot, eight-inch wide shoulders and six-foot sidewalks. The existing bridge is subject to local scour and its foundation is categorized as scour critical. The seawalls along Pine Key Cutoff extend into the channel to accommodate the bridge approaches, causing a restriction in channel width. The bridge approaches widen to include a striped median with raised landscape areas. The roadway widens further to include a 20-foot landscape median west of 6th Avenue and east of 4th Avenue. The striped shoulders widen to roughly 11 feet and the six foot sidewalks on the bridge connect to four foot landscaped sidewalks that end at the adjacent intersections. The proposed improvements consist of constructing a new bridge with three 60 foot spans, which will provide greater vertical and horizontal clearances under the bridge. Madonna Boulevard provides sole access to the Monte Cristo community from the Pinellas Bayway and plays a critical role in facilitating traffic within Tierra Verde during emergency response and evacuation periods. Improving the reliability and structural capacity of the bridge will enhance emergency access and evacuation efforts and ensure the targeted 75-year service life of the structure. The project will also include six-foot wide sidewalks from 6th Avenue to 4th Avenue to enhance pedestrian safety. The seawalls at the bridge abutments will be replaced and reconfigured which will improve channel flow and reduce scour. Utility improvements include a new water main and reclaimed water main that will be installed under the bridge along the south side of the bridge. A sanitary line will also require replacement on the north side to clear the proposed construction. The new bridge will carry two 12-foot lanes with 5-foot 10-inch shoulders and 6-foot raised sidewalks with reinforced concrete bridge barriers with aluminum railing. The proposed bridge profile shows the improved horizontal and vertical clearances. The longer bridge spans allow for a greater horizontal opening for the channel, which will reduce strong currents and scour. The greater vertical clearance is a result of the type of beams proposed for this bridge and the longer spans. The proposed roadway configuration will be similar to the existing configuration, but the roadway will rise to accommodate the new bridge profile. The approaches to the bridge will be reconstructed to provide two 12-foot lanes, six-foot wide shoulders, and six-foot sidewalks behind new curb and gutter. The edge of pavement will be shifted inward toward the center line of Madonna Boulevard, and new curb inlets will be installed to provide positive and effective drainage. The existing narrow sidewalks will be replaced to ensure compliance with the Americans with Disabilities Act. Since Madonna Boulevard is the sole access for the island community, two-way traffic must be maintained throughout construction. So the proposed bridge will be constructed in two phases. This phased construction will provide a temporary one-lane two-way condition controlled by portable temporary traffic signals. In the first phase, traffic will be shifted to a single lane on the existing bridge, while a portion of the existing bridge is demolished and the proposed bridge is partially constructed. Traffic will then be shifted to a single lane on the newly constructed bridge and maintained in the same manner while the remainder of the existing bridge is demolished and replaced. 
This is a plan view of the temporary traffic control layout. Phase one is shown here with traffic in both directions sharing a single lane maintained on the existing bridge. Phase two follows a similar mirrored layout to carry traffic on the newly constructed portion of the bridge while the remainder of the existing bridge is removed and the remaining section is constructed. Temporary traffic signals will be installed at 6th Avenue and 4th Avenue to allow traffic to cross the bridge one direction at a time. These signals will also control traffic on 6th Avenue and 4th Avenue. Additional temporary traffic control may also be necessary for installation of the utilities, but that operation is not anticipated to reduce the number of traffic lanes. The design and permitting phase for this project are ongoing and Pinellas County anticipates completion by the spring of 2024. Right-of-way acquisition is not required for this project. Once the design is complete, permits obtained, and a contractor is selected, construction is estimated to take 27 months. You may visit the project webpage at the address shown here for the latest project information, schedule, and upcoming events. You may also email comments to the project manager, Mr. Amin Vasuli, at the address shown. Thank you for your interest in the proposed Madonna Boulevard Bridge Replacement Project and for taking time to view this presentation.